Okay, okay, I'm on a review cake tonight. Can't help it. Whatever. Anyways, tonight we are going to do a review right now on Red Velvet Dream. There you go. Let me put it to you this way about this juice, okay? I've had this bottle for a week and a half. I went to a couple of the shops and let a couple of people that I know personally try it. And I haven't baked out of this bottle but a couple of times. And you see it's a lot less than I have a bottle. I've had people literally ask me if they can buy it off of me. I don't know about you. But when a juice is so good people are wanting to buy it off you. When you tell them that you can't buy it locally yet. It speaks volumes. Okay, well, let's get to this flavor profile, shall we? Okay, <clears throat> Red Velvet Dream. It's Red Velvet Fudge and Graham Cracker. On the inhale, you get the Red Velvet. You get a lot of the chocolate. And on the exhale, you get the smooth mixture of the Graham Cracker and the chocolate at the same time. Fudge. Chocolate fudge. Fudge is chocolate. Don't correct me. vapor reduction though dude eighty twenty blend <clears throat> and these are little hits that I'm taking that you're seeing these huge clouds come off of <laughs> Sorry, I've been vaping for quite a hot minute now, so, uh, we all know. Gotta stay hydrated. Can't help it. Alright, let me tell you my honest opinion of this juice. I'm not a Red Velvet fan. I'm normally not a dessert fan at all. But this Red Velvet... I've tried quite a few of them before by different companies. I've never found a red velvet that is spot on to me. Never. This is spot on. I mean, to a T. It is like you are sticking a piece of red velvet cake in your mouth, mouth watering. I mean, just like need for more. It's crazy. <clears throat> I'm starting to think that he just gets these desserts and melts them down into a liquid form and mixes them with some BG. It's really what I'm starting to think. Because nobody should be able to get these juices tasting this perfectly. Seriously. They're perfect. Okay, anyway. Do you see this? I got a feeling if I don't redrip this, I'm about to take a dry hit. Oh yeah. That would have been bad. <clears throat> the good thing about this red velvet that he makes, it's clear. Not staining your cotton. And I don't know about all of y'all, but every now and then, when I'm at work, <clears throat> not at home where my bag of cotton's sitting, if I want to change up flavors, I dry my cotton out real good without burning it. A lot of stronger flavors, I'm sure we all know this, you can't really do that. They stay. I haven't found one of his liquids that you can't dry out the first time. The flavors are extremely, extremely potent, I guess is the word I would use. I don't know. Don't judge me. It's late. Anyway, um, his flavors are spot on. They're strong. I mean, there's no way you can miss them. It's not one of those dull flavors. They are very much there. Um, but at the same time, I haven't seen any of his liquids that hasn't been clear. Um, which, to me, is a good thing. I don't like all these green, blue, pink, purple liquids. I mean, 
just doesn't seem safe to me. <clears throat> I know some of them are personal preference, I guess. Mainly because I don't like my cotton being stained blue. I don't like my cotton being stained red. I don't like it being stained pink or purple or green. Well, I don't know. Green would probably be cool. I like green. I like green a lot. This is ridiculous. Hang on. Keep in mind, the air conditioner on my house is running at like full speed ahead right now. So, <clears throat> I don't know how well those shots would just work, but here, to me, those are some pretty good clouds. <clears throat> and I know big clouds. I blow them daily because I love clouds. I chase them. And then I follow them when I get tired of chasing them. You know? Give this dude a check out. <clears throat> BigLickVapor.com. Great liquid. Um, like I said, I mean, you really, I can almost guarantee you that if you tried his liquid and it's something, flavors that you've tried before that you've been trying to find one, but couldn't find one that you really liked, this dude's it. Trust me. I'll put it this way. I'm in love. <laughs> Check him out. See y'all later.